I am a King's Pointer. My name is Lieutenant Colonel Austin DeHaiti. I am a class of 1990 and I'm an engineer. I attended King's Point because it was the uh, academy that afforded me the most options. I think at the time I had had an aspiration of wanting to be a Marine and this, this and Naval Academy were uh, one of the two recent, uh, ways to get there. But I had many, many more options at King's Point and so uh, that uh, along with some alumni who convinced me that this was the uh, place to be uh, convinced me to come here. As anyone has probably told you, Sea Year is probably one of those gems here at the Academy. Uh, I uh, spent my Sea Year time on four different ships. The first ship uh, to uh, the middle, uh, the Mediterranean rather. Um, spent uh, 15 days from New Orleans to Alexandria, Egypt. Then basically hopscotched all the way back through uh, Haifa, Israel, Paris, Greece, two ports in Italy, port in Spain, back out the uh, Mediterranean and back to, co back to the uh, continental U.S. My second ship took me to uh, the uh, Northern Atlantic, Germany, Holland, England. My third ship took me down to the Caribbean, uh, multiple ports there. And my last ship, believe it or not, uh, stayed in the Gulf of Mexico, where uh, I uh, basically hugged the coastline from Texas uh, to the east side of Florida and back uh, several times. I participated in uh, many of the activities here at Kings Point. I uh, played football. I would participate in track and field. Um, I uh, played a little soccer. Uh, ultimately, my last two years, I joined the sailing team and uh, found that to be immensely gratifying. Uh, there's a, uh, a real big uh, supporter of the sailing program here. I think it's one of the best secrets here at Kings Point and one that everyone should partake in. Uh, but also, during my four years, I was a member of many clubs to include the uh, what was then called the Ethnic Culture Club, which was a, uh, a group of midshipmen who, uh, in essence, uh, maintain relations with local organizations and local uh, colleges and universities. Um, that also afforded me many opportunities to leave the campus and to get about uh, in the local New York, uh, New England area. Um, and uh, of course, I uh, was a member of the uh, Bulldog Squad here that uh, prepared me for uh, Officer Candidate School. I graduated Kings Point in uh, June of 1990, and I had not yet gone to OCS, so I graduated as a Naval Reservist. Uh, three weeks later, I was at OCS, and uh, six weeks after that, I uh, was commissioned a second lieutenant. Uh, I've been in the Marine Corps now 21 years. I had a flight contract uh, from Kings Point, and I have flown Harriers for the last 21 years, and uh, have uh, enjoyed that very uh, immensely. Um, I've deployed uh, all over the world. I've been to combat three times. I am now at the Pentagon, where I'm uh, uh, performing the duties of a uh, analyst at uh, headquarters Marine Corps, and then subsequently. Uh, working at, uh, for, the office, for the Office of the Secretary of Defense. I think uh, coming to Kings Point was certainly, uh, for me, uh, a gateway. Uh, I had uh, other opportunities to attend uh, schools uh, from my home state of Texas. I had ROTC opportunities and scholarships. Um, but I, I really had a, a, uh, a knack for that extra challenge. And so when it came down to it, for me, it was Kings Point or West Point. And ultimately, um, after meeting a few uh, Kingsman graduates who were uh, living in the Houston, Texas area where I'm from, I was convinced that this was the place. I think the main reason, again, was options. From Kings Point, you're able to go into the uh, active duty military, or you're able to work in the private industry, or you're able to be a reservist and, and kind of uh, do both. Um, uh, for me, uh, the opportunity to uh, test myself and challenge myself as a uh, young man and, and uh, to see if I could be and could measure up to the Marines was the uh, one of the primary reasons because I knew that always left that door open. Uh, since having graduated from Kings Point, those options uh, have, have only multiplied since. And so 21 years later in my career, as I consider my next career, uh, those Kings Point roots uh, still uh, are alive. In fact, uh, I just attended a, an alumni social yesterday in my area. Uh, and a very vibrant group and I keep in touch with the Kings Point uh, Alumni Association through all the social media these days. So there are many, many opportunities uh, to uh, plug in, but I think ultimately uh, it was the education, it was the options that I had and uh, my personal aspirations of wanting to uh, challenge myself and uh, uh, meet the uh, test of being a Marine.